Hey everyone, it's John from Tudor Race Patchwork and today we're going to be playing with hem stitch needles, okay? Or otherwise known as winged needles. So you can see if we look at this needle here, it has wings both sides. Basically with this needle, it divides and separates the fabric to create a really gorgeous decorative stitch. Um, most of the time, you're going to be using a, a light to medium weight fabric. So now that the uh, needle is in and threaded, we can start playing around with some of the built-in stitches on this machine. Um, the main principle for this being the um, more frequent that the needle hits almost in the same point, the, the larger um, sort of punch mark it will make, although it doesn't, like I said, punch through your fabric actually sort of separates and divides. So I'll choose a really um, nice stitch for this. Let's just show you. Okay. And just watch, it's nothing. Okay. It's going to be very boring for a second. I'll put my foot down. Okay, so you'll see, it doesn't look too impressive to begin with, but if I now hold it up, you can see it's doing this sort of a divide and separate into the fabrics, okay? And there are lots of stitches you can use. I've had to really exaggerate it so that we can see it here on the camera, but in a very Blue Peter style, here are some other stitches, just quite simple. I mean, this is just a treble stitch, but again, with that punch hole that it makes, it, it becomes a really nice decorative stitch. So this was traditionally used on um, sort of christening gowns and things. So I've really enjoyed having a play with the machine and it's built in stitches. And, and I put it on top of a really nice bright um, linen here with a really bold statement piece. And I think it create a really sort of modern uh, um, look and feel. So you can see I've just used again some of my built-in stitches on the machine and again like I was saying earlier when you've got the pattern so that it repeats on the same point that's when it creates this fantastic look. Um, so I'd recommend coming along getting your hem stitch needles and really having a, a good time just playing with the needle with your machine and it's a really good way to use all those stitches that you wouldn't ordinarily use.